hello guys welcome to my youtube channel in this video we will learn what is the drush what are the difference command and what is the use of drush commands in a drupal so the drush is the command line shell and unique scripting interface for a drupal so using the drush uh, we can perform mm -hmm. the different operations like uh, update the update.php, execute SQL queries, uh, run the content migration, install install the uh, contributed modules or uh, uninstall the contributed models using the Drush. So we don't need to go to the UI of our Drupal backend and it will save a lot of time. So Drush name came from the two words, first three character represent the Drupal and last two characters came from the shell. So for this video, first I will install the one module using the composer. So I, I, I have chosen the external link pop-up model. I will install this model using the composer. So make sure you have already installed the composer in your uh, system. So now, I have, uh, now I am at the path of my in the root folder of my project. So my project name is the dev.php. I will now download the external link pop-up using the composer. So that uh, you can see using the composer I have downloaded the model within a 5 to 6 seconds. Now uh, I will use the drush to enable this model. So before uh, to use drush commands you need to first install the drush in your system. So for that uh, you can uh, install drush using this command. So copy this command and run this command in your root folder. So for I have already installed this uh, drush in my system so I will run this command so it will show the version of the drush so the current version of drush is the 11.1.1 to, to install that module external link pop-up module you need to run the drush en and the machine name of the model so the machine name of model is external link and underscore pop-up so just paste here and uh, execute this command after installing this uh, this the message is this external link pop-up model is successfully installed now we will go to the backend of the website and I will show in the list that external link pop-up model is enabled or not. Now I will search for the external link pop-up model to check if it is uh, installed or not in my website. So you can see the external link pop-up model is installed. <coughs> now next command is uh, if you want to check the list of all modules with their status like uh, the model is installed or not so for that the command is uh, dash pml so it will list out the all extension of the modules which are available in your website with the their status and the version so to clear this result just enter run the command clear so next command is uh, if you want to uh, see the logs in your watchdog so for that the command is ws hyphen show it will list out all the so the command is wd dot show uh, wd hyphen show it will show the list of all uh, messages which are logged in the watchdog. Uh, next command is uh, 
if you want to clear the cache so the command is dash and cc means clear cache it will list the it will list the components like uh, for which part you want to clear the cache i will select the seven i want to clear the cache of views so you can see that within a seconds we are, we are now able to clear those caches if you want to rebuild rebuild the if you want to rebuild the cache so for that command is dash cr so it will again it is similar like kind of similar to the uh, dash cc but it will uh, dash cr will clear all your cache Uh, next command uh, now if you want to uninstall the model which we have installed right now external link pop up for that command is drush pm uninstall and the machine name of the model external link pop up this command will uninstall the model and we will check if that model is uninstalled or not yeah it shows the message that the model is uninstalled now go to again in the models and we'll check if that uh, this checkbox is remove or not now we will search for the external link pop-up model you can see this model is not disabled so again if you want to search for different commands just go to the this official website of the drush and you can search for the different types of the commands which you want to perform on uh, your website so right now we are just uh, see how to show the list of all watchdog logs so for that command is dash watchdog hyphen show or in the short form we can write the wd hyphen show so i will add this link as well in the description of the video so i hope you like this video and please don't forget to like and subscribe the channel thank you